Okay, in this next video, I'm going to show you uh, uh, some footage from earlier in the year of some beautiful Rex Otter Bunnies and uh, Broken Bunnies. They were really my pride and joy at the time. This is right around the beginning of the year. And they were um, <clears throat> they were Snowballs and Boo Boo's Offspring. This is Snowball here. And he's got a lot of black and uh, black otter genetics, but he's a great bunny. He's just been the greatest, but I'm going to be rehoming him probably pretty soon. Just wanted to show you some of his offspring before I do. And this is from early early in the year, around January. This is the new buck that's going to be kind of replacing Snowball. His name is Rufus. Hey, Rufus. Let's let everybody see Rufy Toofies. He's my pretty boy. He's my pretty little bunny baby. He's a little sturdy pet. Hey, Rufus. He's pretty. He's kind of a... I don't know. He's kind of a broken, casterish, um, almost a fawn. But, uh... He's going to be my new, and I'm going to go back, and uh, a close friend of mine has the uh, a broken buck, and you'll probably be able to see um, some of his sisters in this video, and I'm going to go back and get him uh, here pretty soon, as soon as I rehome Snowball. But this is my new tricolor baby, Peepipo, and um, Clementine. This is my darling Clementine right here. She's my new, one of my new breeding does. This is one of um, Boo Boo and Link Link's babies. So I've got five real good breeding does. I may be keeping some more of the um, the casterish color ones, but uh, let's let's take a look at this video from earlier in the year of the otters and the uh, the broken babies. And they're real healthy bunnies. I'm gonna keep one and uh, home the other. And I've got two does over here. The two does are from uh, Boo Boo, and the two otters are from flopper so uh i noticed her a couple days ago pulling hair and and it wasn't but within a day she had already had the litter hey mama can you see the little baby bunnies let me tell you little babies all right boo boo had a surprise litter on me the other day i noticed her pulling hair a couple days ago when uh the very next day she had a uh, let a litter loose on me thankfully this was a small litter, so it didn't... These guys over here are black otter males, and they're real pretty rabbits. And these are little... These are what I call them magpie bunnies. That's boo-boos. Boo-boos does. There's two does, and then there's two males. So we're breeding, we're breeding pairs if anybody's interested. So we're going to... Um, we're going to take the bunnies out and have a look at them. I hadn't got a good look at them yet, and I figured that would be part of the... Why are you binking around? What are you binking for? You want them Cheerios? My baby loved Cheerios. We're going to take a look at them. I hadn't got a good look at them yet, so try to. Let me see if I can get some better light here. Come here, little bunnies. Little pretty babies. One of the little babies was real panicky, so I just decided I'd, I'd wait a couple more days before I uh, premiere those two little guys. Um, and I will share a tip. Uh, with you in that video about how to have bigger litters this is uh, something I got from somebody that breeds uh, has over a thousand does and uh, they gave me a secret formula for how to um, how to get them a bigger and I love that one I heard somebody tell me one time that the that floppy ears were a DQ like for show rabbits but I think they're adorable this one's got a little floppy ear and this one's little ear tips flop so I they're they're good bunnies in my book. <laughs> I, lo I love them. They're a lot of little puppy dogs. Um, and in the next video, I'm going to show you Boo Boo's surprise litter. She somehow managed to... <laughs> and I, don't, I don't remember when she... There was like one time where the two of them got out of the cage, but I could have swore I kept them from breeding, but they, they must have done it very quickly. These guys were born December the 3rd, so that makes them almost seven weeks to eight weeks old almost eight weeks so i love them they're just they give me something to look forward to each day and uh by finding homes for these some of these guys i can have new litters and uh and this one i just wanted to show the little black otter babies these uh these guys uh two of them are coming up on nine weeks and one of them is coming up on seven weeks and um they're real healthy real pretty and uh, i'm gonna keep one of the I'm going to keep one of the older of these two here uh, for, for breeding purposes. I think I have one um, magpie broken bunny that's uh, 
that's a doe. And another one I haven't really quite come to a decision on yet in terms of its gender. And uh, see if we can... Hey! What are you doing? <laughs> I like that one. I'm, I'm, he's one of the ones that are available. But he's one of my favorite ones. I love all these little rabbits. They are really a, a very good stress reliever for me. And they're all just very friendly. They friendly bunnies. They do friendly. Yeah. And this one is a more of a seal, I guess. He's got a little bit of coloration around his eyes, but the others are very noticeable. But these are all male, male bunnies. And um, like I said, I'm keeping my doe. I have uh, two does that I started the rabbitry with. Uh, this one right here. This is Flopper. You mean Floppers? And in there we got Boo Boo. And they are really good bunnies. And their daddy is a albino. <clears throat> but I've got two litters that are roughly the same age, just a couple of weeks apart. But I want to see if I can get a close up just so people that were interested can, can see them. Hey, you little boy. What you doing? What you doing, dear the pretty thing? Yeah. And you see the colors around the eyes and the ears. They real pretty, real friendly bunnies. I try to I try to interact with them every day, as I'm down here working to just get them, um, just acclimated. And I'll show you these little babies, or my little bun, my little broken bunnies, and they're uh, I've heard people call them magpies, but they're really not a a consensus on what they call some of these colors. Sometimes they're just Call them whatever. Uh, hey, look at the camera, you pretty thing. You so pretty. You so pretty. Pretty little thing. What? Putting your nose on the camera. You look like a lot of little Dalmatians. That's what I, when I first did my first video on them, they looked like little puppy dogs. And they still do, kind of. They look like little Dalmatian. They look like little Dalmatian dogs. They little puppy rabbits. You puppy rabbit. You little puppies. But anyway, that's the first video for this channel. Be sure to subscribe. I'm going to put a a link in the description. And it's going to be a like a guide. Where you can uh, just download it. And uh, I don't know what I'm going to put in there. I just want something I can give to people that come to the channel that um, that will kind of give them more information just on, I guess, whatever I feel is appropriate to share. I'm just taking care of rabbits and just, uh, but you'll see it there in the description uh, box below. And make sure to subscribe because this is a new channel and I'm, and I'm looking forward to doing more. Um, I'm going to be having some more new letters here pretty soon. And so that's it. That's it. Look. What? What are you doing, little buddy? Pretty. You go pretty.